Hey guys, it's new. So if you've been following me for a while, you probably have heard that I have things like fibromyalgia, narcolepsy, and a lot of cervical spine problems. I grew up with a condition called atlas subluxation, which is when the first vertebra in your spine is misaligned, causing compression of the brain stem, pinching of the vertebral arteries, all that fun stuff. So. As a result, my spine is a little bit out of whack and uh, it causes me a lot of pain daily. That's my main source of the pain and it radiates out and just causes all kinds of problems in my hands, my arms. It makes a lot of issues and it's uh, the main reason that I have been sick so long. Uh, basically my whole life is because of this misalignment making things extra hard on my body. But today I wanted to talk about some stuff that has really helped my spine to start healing and to start feeling better. Pretty much always I have had trouble sleeping, not just the narcolepsy and the insomnia and the chronic pain and stuff, but just especially in the past four or so years with all the intense problems that I've been having. Sleeping is very uncomfortable, laying down is very uncomfortable, my spine just does not, it's very sensitive, my neck is very weak. It's always been very hard for me to get comfortable and I didn't know that I had bad sleep position habits, like I would either sleep with no pillow or like a poopy stupid pillow that doesn't offer any support. I posted on my blog after my uh, procedure that I was having a lot of trouble getting comfortable because everything was just trying to heal and shift back into place and I just was tossing and turning all night because of my neck and because of my upper spine. And so someone who follows my blog recommended a pillow that they bought for their neck and upper spine problems. After some consideration and some research, I decided to get it. My dad actually got it for me and I'm really, really super grateful because this pillow was like $80 and it's not something that I could afford at that time because I hadn't been working um, because of how sick I was. So, uh, let's talk about the pillow finally. It's this. It looks like this. It seems kind of big. Um, it's Sleep Right. I'll put the whole name. I don't remember. It's Sleep Right something something numbers and letters and all that. Um, I got it on Amazon and this thing, oh my god, it has made such a huge difference. Not only is it memory foam, like, it's just, see, it's very, it's very squishy and soft but supportive. It's just perfect, and I think I got the medium size. I mean, I could have gotten the small, but I think that the medium is perfect. So, it has this little, um, I don't know what to call this. It's like a little boop, it goes down a little bit um, to allow your face to have plenty of space to rest. Now, what I love about this, it, it was hard to get used to at first, because I'm not used to using this much space between me and the bed, right? I'm usually like a very small pillow or no pillow, and with this, it created all this space that I didn't have before, which allowed all this nice blood flow to come here, freed up my shoulder, because that's the thing too, like you, I can never get comfortable with my arms and my shoulder, so I'm just always like, bleh. But this frees up all that space, so my arm is just like there, and not being slept on uncomfortably, not doing weird things to my shoulders. It's pretty great, and this thing is so worth the money. I'm so thankful to the person who suggested it to me. So thankful for my dad, uh, to my dad for buying it for me. And even when I'm having like a narcolepsy flare-up or the nerve pain that usually keeps me up at night, um, this thing is just so comfortable, and I do feel that it's improving my quality of sleep, even on those bad nights. And just in general, like resting on it is really nice when I'm taking my midday rest break when the pain gets a little bit too high for me to keep working on stuff. So yeah, this thing is really, really awesome. Um, I'll put a link below. I definitely say check it out if you have fibromyalgia or chronic pain, neck problems, spine problems, sleep problems, anything. I think that everyone could benefit from this even if you don't really have any problems, like severe problems. Sleep is very, very important and uh, I will always be encouraging everyone to do what they can to find the best sleep that they can. Okay, so the next thing that has been really important in my sleeping and my spine healing and all that is a knee spacer. So it's this thing here, and it has this strap so that when you put it between your knees, between your legs, you pull the strap around and you strap it in here with Velcro, see? and uh, it'll stay in place. Now, the reason that this is important is because when you're sleeping on your side, it creates that space between your knees to help keep your spine in a healthy sleeping position, keep it straight. That has been really, really important for me in my healing process. 
like I said before, healing hurts a lot. It is very painful and uh, I have noticed a lot of things going on up here and in my whole body, to be honest, since my procedure in January. And uh, so every night I've been sleeping with my special sleep right pillow, my knee spacer, and I just grab one of my old pillows and I put it between my arms so that I have something here. And I've been doing that for a while, even long before I knew why it was helpful. It just, I noticed one day that it helped me sleep better when I had my giant shark stuffed animal in between my arms. And so then I started using a pillow or, you know, sometimes I still use a stuffed animal because it's, it's comforting, it's nice to hold something fluffy and soft. It does take some getting used to and sometimes I get lazy and I'm already in bed and I'm like, ugh, I forgot my knee spacer and I like have to force myself to get up and go get it and sometimes I'm just too tired and I don't and I'll just put whatever I can find on my bed between my knees and yeah, <laughs> it happens, you know, everyone has their lazy moments. Sometimes it can get a little bit awkward because I do toss and turn a lot, I have to change position. Even with my nice pillow, I have to find you know, the right pressure and the right position for my neck. Um, but eventually I get in the right position and then I can rest really, really well. And I really do feel that that has improved my quality of uh, recovery and rest and all that kind of stuff. So I highly recommend it. Please get these things. They will help you in the long term too because if you're sleeping in bad position, that's micro traumas and over time you could end up with some spinal problems like me and you don't want that please don't end up like me it's not fun take care of yourselves get some nice pillows get you a knee spacer okay all right guys thank you so much for watching bye probably know that I grew up with at Hey guys, it's new. So if you've been following me for a while, you probably have heard that I have things like fibromyalgia, narcolepsy, and a lot of cervical spine problems. I grew up with a condition called atlas subluxation, which is when the first vertebra in your spine is misaligned, causing compression of the brain stem, pinching of the vertebral arteries, all that fun stuff. So. As a result, my spine is a little bit out of whack and uh, it causes me a lot of pain daily. That's my main source of the pain and it radiates out and just causes all kinds of problems in my hands, my arms, it makes a lot of issues and it's uh, the main reason that I have been sick so long. 